What's up guys? Good morning. Okay, how do you like? I'm gonna show you my new skirt. I'm gonna have this linked on LTK. If you've been around here for a while, you know I like to make um, blanket skirts because I get freezing cold with the AC going that I usually either do this or I wrap it up here, but we're just covering the legs today. I have on shorts and I'm kind of not sure if I wanna keep shorts on. Okay, what's up? Good morning, how are you? Today is Wednesday. Spring break is over, not for school, but for cheer. So they have Capri and Seb have their tumbling classes and Brynn actually has practice. So we're back at it. I'm ready. I'm ready for comp. I'm ready for summit. I'm very excited. Okay, so the agenda for today. I, okay, so Cap and I are going to take a trip to Target. We'll take you guys with us. I am going to go to Chicken Salad Chick because I am wanting some food items from there. I'll show you what I get. I do want to swing by the house. I'm just anxious to start living there, guys. I think I'm going to like talk to Daniel see if there's anything that would be helpful for me to take over there today because why not? <clears throat> it's, it's you know, easy to get there, so I'm going to ask him. Maybe we'll pop over there for a little bit. Yeah, so thanks for being here. This weekend we're going to do something fun. I'm very excited. We're going to do something fun on Easter and something we haven't done in a long time, so stay tuned for that. Oh, this is very random. I only got one comment. That's it. So I know sometimes influencers come on and be like, oh my gosh, I've gotten so many DMs this, answering, asking this question. Nope, I just had one person. Somebody asked my, how, that my hair looked really good and what I've, been, what I've been doing. And I'm like fumbling my words again today. So here's the short, I have a couple things. I've been using Pantene on my hair. Cap and I have been. I stopped using the super expensive high-end shampoos. I know, I really have because I saw this girl talking about it on TikTok. So I wash my hair every other day. I don't do the whole once a week, ugh, that's yucky. So it's a myth. Guys, you can wash your hair as often as you like. I wash my hair every other day and I use Pantene, but I have a, a couple other things that I do use in the rotation. Also, I don't get my hair done. I used to get it done, like highlighted every seven weeks. Now it's more like every three months. Also, I've been using K18. So that's that, you know, hair, kind of like a mask, but it's not, it's a product you use after the shower. So I've been using that. That is an expensive product. So that is not, that is the expensive product that I do use, but Pantene conditioner and shampoo is what I use on the daily. Um, I did just order and it came in Amazon because I saw somebody talking about it. Our water here is hard and just full of minerals and metals and stuff. I got a metal detox shampoo and that is what I used this morning and that is what I used the other day. So I won't use that every day. I'll just use that occasionally just because our water here is so bad. But Pantene and K18. All right, so I know this is like incredibly random, but I'm gonna take a couple things over to the house. I'm gonna take our, what is this called? Uh, skillet, what, what is this called? You guys, dang it. Okay, I'm gonna take this. What's this called, Cap? What, do you, what is this? Why am I drawing a blank? Okay, we don't know, but we're taking this over. And this is like my whole coffee, I need to um, wipe off coffee setup that was normally like here. So I'm just gonna take, I'm gonna take this over and put this in the kitchen. And also, I wanna finish the girls' bathroom. Like it's basic, it's just, I'm just putting some white things in their bathroom. So I'm gonna look at Target for a few things for their counter. And slowly but surely, our final day is coming up. So we are slowly moving in, but we do have movers coming soon to take all the big stuff. And then that'll be it for us, like bye bye. So. Check out this old like setup telephone, like you know, old school telephone. Um, okay, so back at the other place, our coffee setup had this and that plant on it with the little sugar container, my little espresso pods go in there, but this is too tall to put under there because it hits. So I think I'm gonna that was so loud. So I think I'm gonna have to get another little small something to put there and then the Nespresso. And ac actually, I'm not even sure the Nespresso is gonna fit under here. Yikes. Hmm, decisions. I don't know. I guess we'll just have to see. Otherwise, I don't know where the heck we'd put it. Maybe right here? Yeah, that's like there, that's kind of a, oh, it stink, but yeah. Oh, can you do me a favor? Can you go get the um, plant in the back seat? Yeah, get that for me. Lucky, lucky. 
Okay, we're ready. All right, okay. let's see. Let's see if this was better today than yesterday's. I think yesterday's was pretty, pretty good. Okay. Ooh, Ooh. it was. Oh, it is. It is. Uh-huh. Okay, look at my color. Perfection. This right here, people, is the color that you want oh, your Duncan so to be. Right here, right here, right here. Who made? The guy that's always in there. Okay, and the lady made mine? I'm not sure who Oh. Made. Okay. They're both in there. All right. All right guys, I am heading out of the door right now because, and it's just me, which feels weird because I always usually have somebody. <sighs> Going to a new cookie place. Time for a cookie. <sighs> cookie. Wow. I have, I have a loss for words. I don't even know what the word is. Wow. Woo, doggy. I'm struggling. You know, review. Ooh, and I'm blinding. Review. That's the word I was looking for. Review. So we're going to. Well, we are going to. Let me look it up. Is it like midnight? Oh, it's kind of hot. So let's get some storms today. Midnight cookies. No. Yes. I've got to get the address, but it's not too far away. So I'm going to get some and we're going to do a review. I have high hopes for these. I am hoping it's not going to go like last week's cookie. Why can I not think of that word? Review. For the love of God, I keep wanting to say reveal. Review. Last week's was bad. Like non-crumble, non you know, but I, I have high hopes for these. I really do. I think they're going to be good. It was wrong. Not midnight. There is such a thing. Night Owl. I knew there was a night in there. Night Owl cookies. Okay, let's go. You guys, these cookies look absolutely insane. They look so good. I'm not gonna lie, they do look better than Crumble, but we're gonna see. So Brookie, and we recently had the Brookie from Crumble, and so it's brownie and cookie. Just their standard chocolate chip. This one is like chocolate with Nutella. This is Oreo, red velvet, and some more. Okay, so Seb has been wanting to join in, which is fun. So, whoa, oh, yum. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! All right, so let's just start first with just their standard chocolate chips. So we're gonna do chocolate chip first, okay? Oh, you don't approve? He doesn't like chocolate chip or something? Yes, he does. <laughs> All right, let's go for it. Not the best. Not the best? Okay, Bone says it's the best. All right, in the middle. All right, keep going. Okay, really quick, guys. I just took a bite of that chocolate chip. Hands down, best chocolate chip cookie I've ever had. Way better than crumble. I hate to admit it. All right, Brookie. So brownie and chocolate chip cookie. Let's go. Let's go. It's good? What? Oh. <laughs> Yes. A little, uh, mm -hmm. Not your favorite? Yeah. Okay, all right. <laughs> all right, Nutella. Let's go for it. Oh. Mm. Wow. Oh, you guys like it? Oh, what's up? <gasps> what? what? Wow. Thumbs up? Seriously? I'm going to try all of these myself. <coughs> Excuse me. And then I'll come back and give you a review. But. But the most important is Hamptons, obviously. And that he tastes said, bad. That tastes bad. Seb? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, God. Weird. All right. Red velvet. Chocolate mouth. <laughs> hey. Oh. Oh. Thumbs mm -hmm. down. What is that? Whoa. Oh, God. Okay. The taste was so good. It's good? Okay. Bones? Not so much. Ooh. Wow. Okay. Oreo. Still got chocolate on your mouth. Bones? Mmm. Oh. Oh, so he's right. right. I know. Not much flavor. No? Well, right. in the middle. Not good, not bad, kind of. <laughs> oh, you like it. Okay. All right, we're doing s'mores. Let's go. Uh, you know what? Okay. Oh. I know what happened. You know. Uh -huh. Come on. Bones, <laughs> you're fine. Oh, Thumbs up, know. Seth. It's good. It's yeah. good. All right. So, what do you think about um, night out cookies? Would, would you, as a whole, would you give them thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up. Okay. Even though you didn't like half of them. <laughs> yeah. So, which do you like better, crumble or these? These. These? No, he would take any cookie. He would take any <laughs> cookie. Yeah, that's true. Crumble or night out? These. Oh, all right. Well, we're gonna try some now. Let's see. Yes. What's your favorite? Mm -hmm. what, what's your favorite? 
Your favorite? What? Your oh. favorite? Did you? Uh, I say I name my favorite. Mm -hmm. Uh, on uh, and uh. Okay. All right, guys. Okay. So, Seb just had a private. It went really well. He is working on. Well, usually he works on his level four, but because Three. tryouts are. What? Yeah. Oh, wait, but are those? Those are. These are. Uh, oh my paper. goodness! Paper? Are we that close? Oh, paper! Oh, that's really. They still have paper straws. That's terrible. It's our um, Duncan, we're, we're by the gym. We're not near our house, but ours by the gym. Or oh, ours by our house plastic. are plastic. And they, they have plastic cups. I know, but I think it's because for the um, oh, this hits. turtles. Yeah, turtles. I can't see you. Okay, so so Seb just had a great private. So normally he's working. Normally he works like level four, but recently, because tryouts are coming out, he's been just really working on. So a few things for tryouts for level three. Specifically, he is a really, well, he's a great tumbler altogether, but his strong suit is running tumbling, running passes and things like that. His weak area, it's hot. His weak area is standing. So we've got to get better at. And so on level three, there the standing tumbling is a standing three but most likely it's gonna be a standing three back handsprings. Most Sirens currently does back handspring, step out, back handspring, back handspring. He can do it, it's fine, but it needs to be clean, like clean and perfect and a little bit faster. So he's been, Caleb's been spending time working, cleaning up his standing. He's just gotta get stronger um, doing that. And then, then when he makes Sirens, we'll get back to all his level four and stuff. So it's really good. And now we have a little bit of a break and we're heading back. It's a busy day for him. We're heading back because he has a stunt private. We cannot forget uh, stunting. I think people think it's all about tumbling for leveling up no. and not at Cheer Florida. Stunting is equally, if not a little bit more important. So he has never really done, he did a little level three stunting in the beginning when he was alternate on Sirens in the very like, beginning, but not elite stuff. Not elite. Like, just so like normal. Nor, just small just little. Just like he'll stretch you Yeah, yeah. So he has a stunt private with some unicorn friends and um, they are gonna be working level three. So that's really exciting. I'm, I need to start charging my phone. So I'm very excited for him to do that. He is a side base, right? Or you mean? Side, side. side. And so he's gonna do that here in a little bit. So we just thought we'd get a Duncan break. And then in 30 minutes, we have to head back to the gym for, we didn't go, we didn't wanna go all the way home. Um, but we'll head back to the gym for him to do the stunt private. And then he has unicorn practice. Right now, so yeah, that's what's that's what's happening. And then I get a break tomorrow. Then you have a break all weekend, no practice on Sunday, so that's good. Oh no practice. No practice. It's Easter. It's Easter. Oh Easter. Um, Sunday? Sunday is Easter. So no practice, so that's nice. And then I'm glad it wasn't on like Saturday. I know. Well Easter is always on Sunday. Well yeah, but like like practice on Saturday, like them making practice on Saturday, or just yeah. or Easter. Like they had like um like uh they switched a makeup it. And switched yeah. it. Oh yeah, exactly. I know. But she's good. So yeah, and then I think I'm Daniel's either gonna bring Capri to the gym or I'm gonna just go back. I'm gonna head back home and grab her. So, anyways, that's our day. That's it. That's all that I've got. Okay, we'll talk to you guys later. All right, guys, it is the end of the night, and oh, I didn't give you guys an update for the night owl cookies. I loved them. I like them. Like, I don't know if I can say I like them better than Crumble. I do. They're what I feel like sometimes Crumble uses the same base, and they probably do for every cookie, so it always has almost the same flavor. I liked the variety, and they tasted different, so I like them. And they're less like. So sweet. Yeah, like agreed. It's literally it's like, crumble is literally oh, a sweet attack. Sweetest. Like you can take yes. one bite and like I can't. Yeah, yeah. Anymore. These. Wait, I want to try these again. I want to try different different ones. Practice went great for both. Good for me. Work was good for you. We're gonna do some shopping and we gotta get ready this weekend for her trip. Daniel isn't here. I can't tell you why. Oh, you can't. You haven't said. Heck no. You look like one of those things where. Oh, okay, I got it. You know, you just. Yeah. Wait. Just wait, so I can't tell you why. Maybe never say? No, oh no, I will. Oh. I will eventually. I got secrets. We got secrets, but we will. Squeak wits. But he is not here. Tomorrow's gonna be fun. We're gonna all go. Daniel has off work, because it's Good Friday, and we're gonna go over to the new house 
and Stop. swim and spend the day there. <laughs> they fight. I was, you know what I was about to do? I was about to make it like a Ruby Frankie like reference and make a joke. Oh, but you know, I was like with you guys fighting or something, oh. I was gonna be like, you've lost your room or whatever. Oh, but then I realized that's just poor taste because it's actually so tra tragic. I just kind of jumped into that actually, didn't I? <laughs> but it's like, if you have, I, you know what? I don't know whether I want you guys to go watch the Ruby Frankie documentary oh. on 2020, but I told you so. I called this several years ago. If you guys don't know, you, you, maybe you don't know, but their lawyer sent me a cease and desist because I tried to speak out against them to to the YouTube gods in the world and I got in trouble for it because I knew, us. then they all blocked us because I knew, I knew this was gonna go downhill bad. I knew that they were bad people and they are. Anyways, it's just all so sad. That's why I was like, mm, that's just, it's not even funny. It's not even funny to make jokes about how awful of a person because those poor kids what they went through is just unimaginable i cried watching it it is just those kids deserve so much more all of them it is just i knew like like in back in 2020 when i called them out and publicly and was going to actually come on this platform and actually daniel and i were going to sit down and we were just going to go like just say all the things we wanted to say i just lost my train of thought there but <laughs> where was i going but with then that? they but yeah then their, their lawyer sent and i should have just ignored it seasons just can't do anything it's a free, it's free speech i could have said i should have said what i wanted to but they got scared because i had and back then back in 2020 we were like like we we were like up there with family yeah. vloggers we were getting lots of views like we were just like in the space right? yeah it was like kind of after that time but we were yeah. still like doing good anyways I mean, now nobody, they probably wouldn't care because whatever, but, so I think they were like, uh-oh. But I knew, I knew that there was bad things happening and I was worried for the kids that something more could happen, and here we are. There were signs. There were so many signs, but like, everybody watched them. Everybody just ate them up because, you know. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna shut up. I, if you wanna know my real thoughts, go over to TikTok. Well, I used to, over to I used to watch them a lot just because I would, I, I, I wasn't watching it because of that like I, not really because i thought it was weird then but i watched them because i would just like laugh at it because i yeah. thought she was just so crazy just yeah. for how she was right and now it's like ooh. but honestly can you imagine look evie and i we, we've gone through some phases <laughs> now can you can you imagine seriously though but on a serious one, can you imagine when we went through those like and it wasn't that bad but i'm just saying yeah, when we went through to, that, like other things yeah, yeah, yeah. Really wasn't, right but. Can you imagine if I, if I shared that publicly, what you did, and every moment that I, can, like, the, the discipline that I or did. I sleep on a beanbag. Yeah, yeah, it's, no. It's not even funny to joke about, honestly, but, I mean, whatever. But, like, no, what I'm saying is, is can you imagine if I shared yeah. all those intimate details of our, of what you went through yeah. with, with, with YouTube? Like, that's what she did. Can you imagine? Yeah. Like, I would be so like, mad. How, how mortifying. Yeah. How humiliating. Like, yeah. I, I just, I cannot imagine going in and putting down the camera and, and talking to Evie about what was, she was going through and how I was going to take her phone and blah, blah, blah. And, or like sitting there going through my phone. Yeah. And like, oh. and like just like talking about everything. Everything. Like, like that's like, oh, I could just, I cannot imagine parenting like that. That's not parenting. But I... I mean, we've shared a lot, a lot, but never the intimate details of, yeah, parenting. of parenting and privacy and like, I just, I can't. You also always asked us for things oh, that we yeah. filmed. Like if it was gonna be like a period video yeah. or like something that was more personal, she yeah. would always ask like, oh, are you comfortable filming a period yeah. video? And I stopped. It was, I did a period video with you when you were mm -hmm. older. And then after that, I stopped doing those because I felt like, I just thought those were inappropriate, yeah. you know? And so we never talked about that with Brand or Cap, like yeah. with you guys, all of that. Like it just, But we I never even got too far in oh, details no. about it. I did like yeah. a, a travel It was bag. a travel, yeah. like that's what we did guys. It was like a travel yeah. kit. Yeah, you and can look it up. For it's, cheer or something. Yeah. Or travel. Like, like I mean, it travel. was not even. It What's was a actually, bring? Like. Yeah, yeah. So we've seen far worse on the internet. Yeah, far worse. Okay, but our food is here. So we're gonna get that, or it's almost here. Yay. So we're gonna close. Okay, I love you guys, and sorry about that kind of like tangent, but it's been, 
it's been like on my mind all of that and just it's just awful and just i think people can trick you on the internet they can and you can say that about me and that's fine don't trust like you know don't judge me good or bad like because uh, you just don't know you somebody you don't know like you don't know us you don't know us, you know? You don't know until you really know someone. And yeah. I think a lot of family vloggers like to be like, we're perfect, like, yeah. oh my gosh, we have like, what, well, you got. <laughs> you can't know someone through a camera lens. You can't, you really can't. All right, that's it. Good night, love you guys.